Hello there, this is Elson Career with Forcing My Colon. And in this video, I'm going to talk about when to use the image tag versus the CSS background image. So let's get to it. So when you come across this dilemma, the first question you need to ask is, is the image content? Example of content can be an article, photo, or thumbnail, or the site logo, for example. Pretty much imagine someone is printing your site page and you don't want them to waste ink on image that has nothing to do with content they are actually interested on. The second reason you want to consider image tag instead of background is the meaning behind it. HTML image tag has the alt attribute which you can you can and you should use to describe the image in context, which helps screen readers scan your site as well as search engines like Google. It's a very important thing to consider if SEO is something you want to improve on. The third and least important reason can be scalability. Image in an image tag always maintains its ratio, so resizing an image is very easy, even though we have many ways to of achieving the same effect using CSS alone or JavaScript. Again, image, um, again, image being content and meaningful are the most important reasons, especially if you want you if you want your site to be printing, screen readers, and SEO friendly. So when it comes to background image. Uh, property anything that does not meet the reason for image tag can be done using this you can use it for non-content imagery example icons pattern textures the quotes here an example page uh, uh, text replacement uh, text replacement um, I think every site should use up to two fonts so if you come across part of the site you want to use a different font you can use image to replace the text for example here in the page um, we have a LinkedIn icon on the bottom footer, uh, which can be replaced for uh, the word LinkedIn. If you don't things are pretty fast these days, use background CSS property to add image to page if loading is a concern. Um, if page loading is a concern, um, that is because you can use CSS sprites, um, image sprites, and use CSS to manipulate it. So you can have single sprite with many images or icons, meaning single download. If you find yourself adding background or anything that are purely cosmetic, use CSS background to add images, patterns, or textures instead. Um, it's better. Um, again, um, this is it for this comparison. Um, I hope you get better judgment from now on. Uh, thanks for watching. See you next video.